Okay, welcome everybody. Um, we are about to start the first game. We are ready. Yes. So the first game should be a mi mirror. Indeed. Indeed. Uh, Indeed. Civilizations. So it's Turks in the south. We have Zaijin in blue. And on the, in the north we have Zayas as green. So the first game uh, in the round one series is played on Acropolis. So it's basically a huge. Uh, heal of both teams or both players start on a huge uh, hill. There is little wood on the on the hill. Um, they have their main gold and main stone on the hill. But if they want to get um, real wood, the real wood sources are only um, down the hill. So, and they are open to attack. So let's look at their maps while they are starting uh, to scout and lure their boars. So I think Zaijin is using us, using also his llamas uh, to scouts and that as well. And I think he has more or better scouting information right now. Uh, he almost thought completely scouted his skill. Um, don't see any luring just yet. I mean boar. Oh, there is one. Oh, no, that's the llama. Um, so... Oh, okay. And Zaijin's map? Great. Zaijin's map is still okay, um, but I think Zayat's wood, especially this part, is really easily defendable, so this is gonna be a good point. He can wall this part too, uh, Zaijin, but it's not that, not that easy. Zero Empires is not here. Um, answer to the question in the switch chat. He is... I don't know. Maybe streaming another game or working, and I think he will start his, his work in three hours. I don't think he will stream this one or any game today. Okay, so we look at Zaijin scouting. Hey, is he has already scouted his main base, and he is now going to the other side to find Zayat. While but uh, he won completely and also the neighborhood, he scouted the neighborhood, he, he didn't scout the wood in the, on the east side. This wood, but, but he is about to find Zaijin. I hope I'm pronouncing they, them better, their names good. Um, what nationality is Zayas? Do you guys know in the Twitch chat? Zayak or Zayjack or I don't know. <laughs> Let's stick with Zayat because his uh, his avatar is a rabbit, so I think it's a Slavic name for rabbit. Um, Zayat is looking for the wood line, um, which is scout, and he also lured one beer and. Populations for 16. Oh, oh okay. that's hit by uh, the town center, the south. That's did. And Zaijin is putting down a uh, blacksmith. And let's look at Zayat. No, he, he's luring his second beer right now. Bar right now. And I don't see any barracks. And he, but he does have the food for a second barrack. Or barrack. Uh, 
side. I didn't see Zaijin taking any gold, so if he's going for a drush, then probably f three militia. Okay, so there is the barrack now from Zayats. Okay, it's so twice. I will try to change it. Is it better now? Is it better now? Slow icon check, okay. So there is a barrack now from both players. Uh, is the mic better? Hell is. Yo, daddy. And one militia out for Zaijin. So the populations are 20 for Zayats and 24 for Zaijin, um, including the two militia, so that's 22. And he got housed right now. Oh, he's building it. And that's interesting. Uh, Zaijin is also taking some deer. Uh, this has very close deer to his mill. Okay, so I will... a little bit better. Then I will try to... Uh, music. Okay. Oh, they are both Russians. Okay. Hi, hello, Zero Empires. Welcome to the stream. Good to see you there. <laughs> okay, so the scout, I think, is. I think Zaijin is gonna lose his scout if Zayat is going to. Uh, go after him. So there is 29 pop for Zaijin and 23 for Zayats. Uh, I think he's almost halfway up, but he didn't rush, but he has a blacksmith down, that's, you know. Uh, he has just one militia out, I think. Yeah, one militia out. And Zaijin... Where is his militia? Yeah, they are on their way. On their way. Pink pink is here. <laughs> Everybody's pink. Uh, okay, this Zaijin. Oh, he scouted the wood line, so I think he will go straight to the wood line. But Zayats, so the rush. But he has only one militia, but uh, Zaijin's scout is really low on health, so I don't think he will engage with that scout, he's just gonna stand there and be a standby if and he will leave Jalir's running. Oh, but no! Uh, Zaijin lost two of his militia to the town center fire, that's very unfortunate. Okay, I'm gonna try to lower the sound a little bit more. Okay. So, so Zayats is feudal, Zaijin is halfway up to feudal and with 27 pop and with 27 pop. Okay. And he's holding off his wood line to protect it, I think, against from any scout that um, would be possible from Zayats. But yes, he's throwing down a stable. And already a scout out, a uh, queued in the stable. Um, but I think he has very not so many villagers on foot to to be able to sustain two stable scout production. So he's mining some wood there. He's he's low on wood, so to seed some farms, he he's gonna need a lot of wood in the beginning. And what's Zaijin doing? Ah, he's walling off his left side. So his wood is gonna be more or less safe. And he also put down a um, stable. And he has a lot more farms seeded. Um, since he stayed a bit longer in, in the Dark Age. But none of the... Okay, so... Zaijin didn't scout any of the 
forest um, downhill. And so I just did scout this wood line or woods here, but he he's I don't I don't see him going down there just yet. He's focusing his villagers on the woods on the top. And he has two idle villagers and he's gonna have more from the berries. And he's also going coming with four scouts from the left side. I think he saw the wood line uh, from Zayats, but it's completely walled now, so he will have to go around. Okay. Uh, what's Saijin doing? Um, he's again going back to the other side. Try to counter. Okay, so there are the scouts in Zaijin's base, and he's using his villagers to fight the scouts. Uh, he did loot, and his plus two attack uh, upgraded in. Does, does he have a blacklist? Or blacklist? No. And Zaijin is throwing down an archer range. He will probably go um, archers and and. Faster castle time, probably. Okay, so there are, there are the scouts in in the wood line of Inzayas's wood line, but he's both have plus two attack. So Zayats, oh, he did make a spearman to counter this the scouts and. There are three more scouts and they are all going to, they are going to the other side I think of the base because they saw the they saw the spearmen on the other side and they will take try oh no, they are just standing around. I don't know what Zayat's doing. Uh, Zaijin in the meantime is in the woodline but he lost all his scouts to the one spearman. <laughs> Yeah, he forgets in the wood line, so and he he was cut off so he would have to go around the other side. <laughs> so Zayat is again in the in the base and he's running from the other side and I think he will gonna go for the gold now for the wood. Uh, but he's gonna be trapped there if uh, any spearmen come. He will have to be careful with those and micro them very well. Okay, so Zaijin is not very close to Castle Age, and I don't see any other military from him. He just lost his whole army on the other side to, to the spearmen there. One, three, two, three, three miles. And Zayat is walling off at the top of the hill and I think none of the guys went down to take some wood from the lower parts and they're I think gonna go alone. We have to come back from this. Oh he's now going Oh Zaijin dead he has two sneaky villagers in <laughs> In the south side, I don't know what he's looking for. Uh, I think he's looking for the wood line. Um, let's see. He doesn't see it yet, so, so he's coming back or just I don't know. Okay, so Zayat. Oh, he has a lot of archers now, so he will come here and just stand around and um, try to pick as many villagers uh, as he can, since Zaijin. He hasn't. Oh, he, he, he now scouted the wood line, woods, uh, or the forest in the, the lower part. Um, okay, so the economically, Zaijin uh, is up to Castle Age halfway, and Zayat is still in a feudal age, but he has a lot of military. Zaijin will. 
he has no military military production right now, so I think he's waiting for a castle and just making spearmen. Yeah, he has, I think... No. Oh, <laughs> he's taking all his villagers to the town center to defend. Oh, why don't he... Why didn't he go somewhere else? Just... Okay, so, but he's now zoned off of his main gold and the other, the secondary gold is in the bottom, so... Um, that's... That's bad. That's real bad. So it will be hard to come back from this, especially if Zayat scouts this wood and it's... it's... Uh, it's gonna be bad. Okay, so... I think Zoyas is just gonna be just gonna walk around the base, um, around the town center, and pick as many villagers as he can. So he's now picking a few villagers from wood, uh, from the berries, and I don't see any way. I I don't see what he's doing. Oh, he's making knights. He made two knights, uh, but he didn't. He has plus plus one defense, so and no upgrades to the attack but he's gonna he's gonna clean this up he has more few more knights he's gonna clean up all those archers so that's a big loss it's almost the whole no he has five more archers at his base that's but he's not doing anything with them I, mm, and he's he's very close to castle now so he will keep quick up i think in a moment uh, he has the 800 food and 200 gold to go up. I think he's lagging a bit for me. Are you going to... Uh, what do you mean lagging a gnarl? Okay, su superb. Uh, how is that you just said? It's, it's okay. So... Uh, Zoyas just left his army in... T okay, so he now noticed. Um, Zoyajin is taking a lot of gold. Uh, I s to sustain his uh, night production and he successfully pushed back um, the attack from Zaijin and he is back at his base. If those knights get in, um, I don't see any spearmen or any army. There are three archers from Zayats. <laughs> this is great, this is so back and forth. So he's gonna use his advantage with the uh, uh, yeah. with the fossil castle age Zaijin to to just try to get back in and um, and kill as many villagers as he can with his knights. Uh, but he's hitting the other side on the right side. Um, did he not? Oh, he has cutting information. Okay, so he <laughs> wants it to get back as fast as can. And he's gonna get all those real gels on the wood line. Um, but Zayat has has lumber camp on the doors, but he is just using one villager to, to cut wood there. And oh, and this is very bad now. Uh, Zaijin is picking all, all these villagers uh, on the gold. So. So Zayat won't be able to create any any archers or not even any camels. But the camels are a good answer to those knights. Monks would be probably better, but <laughs> he's just hitting the houses Zaijin. <laughs> what is it good for? Um, Zayats. Okay, so what's Zaijin doing at his base? Um, nothing, just... He has pretty good economy, pretty well balanced. He has right amount of everything. His gold is extremely saturated. I think he would need a second. He would need a second um, um, a mining camp on the other side, so it would be faster. So he just he had far, five knights at his base, and they're doing nothing. And he's doing throwing down the castle. Uh, to protect um, this left side, his gold and some wood, and also his second town center. He's throwing down the town center while Zayat is still, I think, on one town center, and but he's 
in Castle Age too, so you can make those camels too. Yeah, and he has uh, so many camels there. And those are gonna be enough to push back this attack from from Zaijin, but they uh, didn't upgrade those knights. There is just plus one defense, uh, while those camels have plus one, plus one defense and attack. I. Uh, Florian said it's 28 min class of time. Uh, that's a bit slow, but he he did push hard with his archers. Um, he didn't he did some damage, but not enough. But he still has the higher score now with a lot of account camels. So Zaijin should counter this with some archers. Um, but I don't know what he's doing. Uh, he he pulled back his knights. It's no point attacking now. All right, you should just trade from the other side, and I don't know. He's still on plus one defense, but he has a lot of knights. There is, I don't know, ten knights maybe. Oh, so the castle is up, and he's gonna use. Okay, so he's a bit slow on food and wood, so he will. Have to balance his eco a bit more uh, because he has he stopped producing knives, but he has very high gold. Maybe he's gonna go for uh, a warrior or I don't know. Maybe he should use the market to sell some of those. Oh, he's doing the Janissaries. Uh, how good are they against camels? Can anybody? Does anybody know in the stream? Is it Twitch chat? Uh, okay, so I think he's gonna go nice and in Johnny series against uh, so that's what is he doing? Oh, he's going now to the lower parts to um, maybe throw down the town center. Yes, there is it. The second town center from that. <laughs> yeah, uh, Alice, if you want to cast together. Um, I, it would be great. Alone, I I'm not able to find all those, uh, all the action. So, but Zayas almost completely, except this part, he completely walled off his hill. Um, he has now a town center. He's putting down a town center to the woodland. Uh, to, to, and he has also a secondary gold there. So that's very good. And he still has, has three archers. <laughs> But in, he didn't upgrade it to. He didn't upgrade them to crossbowmen. Uh, does, no, I don't see any upgrades to crossbowmen. Um, so I think Zayat is struggling a bit. Zaijin uh, already has the advantage, a score advantage, and he has quite a few um, Janissaries. <laughs> Yeah, sorry, I didn't uh, turn off Skype. <laughs> uh, okay, um, but Zaijin is gonna find the, sec the wood line and the second second TC from Zayas. And um, I think he will. No, he just counted it. Um, <laughs> but Zayas didn't see it, so he should have just killed that knight. Oh, and he's going for the woods now. Uh, with all his with his whole army. Oh, there are the three arches. So the commons are coming back, and there is there is one knight between, and he did a manganol, and I think he's gonna go for some monks to counter the knights. Um, I think the only thing. Okay, there's there's a thirty save from Zaijin. He's yeah. He's, he's very low on food, but he's probably off. He's on 97 pop, while Zayat is on 84. Oh, that's, that's not that huge difference. But I think what Zaiji needs is um, uh, is a siege workshop. Um, yeah, and Zayat is putting down a castle pretty in the front, so he will need... It's very forward, I think. Um, why didn't 
He puts me across his slumber or... Because he's not protecting anything from here. N not even this gold, not even this wood, so... Um, that's a questionable placement of this castle. Um, <laughs> and the TC is gonna go down only to those knights. But he has... he has only has plus two defense and no... no... Up, no... Um, attack upgrades. Okay, so Zaijin is on spoon and he's still producing some um, knights, but Zayats, he made those monks and they will be pretty great against those, against those knights. Turn. Is anybody going up to Imperial or just stuck? Yeah. Um, Zaijin has a lot of wood and lots of gold in the bank, so I think he should throw them a way more farms, so he's doing that now. Um, I think Zaijin is looking for more places to attack, so he's scouting the second the wood on the other side uh, to see if Zayats did put down anything down there. Uh, but that's a lot of night. And I don't think those two are... Oh, there's three monks now. <laughs> yeah. Um, so there is... There's a sec so <laughs> only second town center from Zayas. And... Oh, and the defend... And the castle in his base to defend from... I don't know from what. He should have put this closer, I think, to his gold, so if any knights come in um, from the north, then so, so he would be able to defend it. <laughs> um, oh, he's moving really slowly with this one, I don't know where he's going with those. Uh, Zayat is just sitting around his base and putting down a fourth? Is this the force, TC? Yes, he's the force, and he also has monks, and he wants the relics. Um, did anybody collect Zayas collect any relics yet? No, he has no relics. He, I think he just uses his monks to, to defend. Him. But there is a relic right, relic right there. He should just take it, and he will have a bit extra gold. He is not that high on gold, but he has a few villagers. Uh, on the golds. So. Uh, okay, so this looks like a pretty good base. And he's... So what Zayat is going for is camels and monks mixed with uh, those Janissaries. Uh, he's producing from two castles, so I think that's an advantage against Zaijin, who has one, one castle only. Uh, so it's a little bit slower. He's only producing. Oh, this is like so many minutes. Okay, that's but it's too many nights there from Zaijin, but those, but those monks are gonna be very effective. Uh, and converting those units. Um, yeah. So there is the second Mangonal from Zayas and he and he outranges the town center so he can hit them. Seven range from the Mangonal and six range. Five range. What? range on the, on the top center and he is repairing this uh, the TC which is I don't see any action right now uh, any military action so Zaijin is going which is nice I think to raid uh, <laughs> because Zayas has a lot of idle villagers there on the wood and that's he should like just send them somewhere else. So. I don't know. Is he just sitting around? Why doesn't he make some light cavalry or something and just raid a bit? Oh. And there is a 
second or third? I didn't see a relic from uh, Zaijin. Oh, and there is a raiding. Um, he has two town centers in the middle and he is throwing down a third one to protect his gold and this part of his base. <laughs> he's gonna be really low on gold uh, in a short while. He can't, he's, he wants to mine from this part. Uh, this gold, but uh, there is a town center from Zaijin and so that's blocking it. Uh, so he brought his, one of his monk up to protect against us. And the town center is going to go up, yes. But I think gold is gonna be a problem for um, Zayat. He has only 300 and he won't be able to kick up his Janissary production. And, oh, and he's halfway up for Imperial. Sorry, I missed it. So Zaijin is up to Imperial and he has these trebuchets. And there. I don't see anything that will. Zayats will be able to counter this here. So that the castle is going to go down and also the town center to that. <laughs> He's just gonna stand with his janitors near the near the trebuchet to protect him and the second trebuchet is coming from uh, and there is a counter upgrade um, uh, from from Zayat and from Zayat. Yeah. No, no, there was a converted unit. Okay, so those knights have been cleared up in Azayat's base, but the security currency is now at 3000 and Azayat has no gold income. So I think it's gonna be a GG soon. Um, while Zaijin has has those relics to provide him with gold and also he has the secondary gold right there so he will be able to produce a lot of cavaliers and he has also lots of farms to be able to afford it. and there is a chemistry upgrade for the services where uh, is the university from his IG So all those villagers are gonna die, and um, that's army standing around and not doing anything. I think he yes, was a GG. <laughs> Great start from Zayas, but he lost his army pretty soon in the feudal age, and he was very slow into castle age, and that basically cost all. It cost him the win, and he was not able to come back from the raiding uh, from. Jeans. Right. Okay. Okay.